Hey everyone, it's Tierra from XCI Royal Solar Energy Solutions. And today I'm going to teach you guys. I'm not just going to talk about a product, which is awesome as well. I'm just going to teach you guys. And I'm going to teach you guys how to determine how much solar system you need, which is a big deal. Because a lot of people don't know how to do that. So it's very simple. You can do it at the convenience of your home. All right, so does this look familiar? Utility bill. We got Lumbee River right here, but it doesn't matter if you're Duke Energy or PWC, it doesn't matter. You guys all get the same kind of deal, okay? What we're looking for is the kilowatts, the watts you're using on a monthly basis. Everyone is pretty much different. So right here you can see, um, you know, the dates of this utility bill specifically, the days, okay, 32, which is really great. Now all utility bills will give you that, so we can work with 32 days. All right. So here's the big number. Here's the here's the most important thing. Kilowatts per hour usage, 1802. Okay? So that's the number we're going to be working with today. And remember 32 days. That's key. And I usually use 30.4 as a, on a monthly basis because there's 30 days in a month, sometimes 31, like February, sometimes 28, whatever. So they gave us specifically 32 days. All right, which is great so we don't have to play a guessing game. So remember 1802, right? The monthly usage, okay? Which is 1802 kilowatt hours, okay? So we want to figure out how much kilowatts daily, all right? So we're going to divide that by 32. You always want to round it up. So we got 56.3. Right? 56.3. Always bring over the unit. Kilowatt hours. Kilowatt hours. All right? So now we know how much daily, okay? But still there's things with that. So you need to know where you are. Me, I'm in Fayetteville, North Carolina. So there's sun hours, okay? The sun hours in North Carolina is 4.5. So that means basically how much the sun is out. So the sun is out for four hours and, and a half, 30 minutes. For you, wherever you're at, it could be two hours, three hours. It just all depends. Look it up, Google it. For us, it's 4.5. So that's the number I'm going to use. 56.3 kilowatt hours. We're going to divide that by 4.5, the sun hours. For, again, for you, it could be two, it could be three, it could be five, whatever. Get the calculator out again. If you want to use your head, go ahead. Round it up. 12.5. 12.5 kilowatts. Not kilowatt hours. Why? Because hours, hours, it automatically crosses out. Remember math class, right? Cross out the units that are the same. So 12.5 kilowatts, okay? And now, here's the thing too. Yes, 4.5 sun hours, but it was raining like yesterday, right? The other day. There's days where it rains and the sun is not out. Bad weather. So we want to be accurate in what we're telling our people. You want to be accurate on how much solar system you need. So we do it off 80% efficiency, okay? So to do the math on that, you're going to convert the percentage to a decimal. So 80%, you're going to change that to 0.8, right? Or 0.80, which I like to do. It doesn't matter. This is where I got 15.625. That's 15.6 when you round it up. So she needs 15.6 kilowatts of system. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That's how you can find out how much kilowatts of system you need. So now, just please comment below the video. Give us some feedback. Tell us what you think. We want we want your questions. You know, we're doing free consultations as well. So please don't hesitate to give us a call or to contact us or to comment below this video. And the way to reach us we're 910-339-5360, and our website is www.xtiroyalsolarenergy. Dot com. All right. So, guys, it's been my pleasure. Um, please stay in tune for our videos in French, English, and other languages coming up soon. All right. So, thank you so much and have a great day.